Okay, this used to be a path. Hey, look up there. There's more carved archways. I still have rocks in my shoes from the last ten slides. Okay, okay. I'm a pro at this by now. So, did two build this place with Avery? I, I can't make sense of it. Uh, neither can I. I mean, if Avery's trying to hide his treasure, why involve another pirate? Uh, maybe he saw him as a part of his crew. Maybe he sent him one of those St. Dismas crosses. Yeah, maybe two took all the treasure for himself. Please don't say that. Well, we're gonna find out soon enough. We're not going back that way. Uh, at least we didn't get dropped in a pit or something. This is... elaborate. You could say that. I don't know. I'm just gonna take the hand out. Whoa. Jesus. It's a pretty elaborate test. Trial? Yeah. When this guy clearly failed. Then let's do better. There's something on the bottom there. It's a bucket. Huh. Okay. Now what? Ah. Bucket filled. All right, pass it up to me. <laughs> Put it back in that big wheel thingy. See what these wheels do. Okay, I think I see what's going on here. Is something with the three crosses? Yeah. I'm guessing we're looking at Jesus, our good thief Dismas, and the jerk thief Gestus. Well, I'm gonna figure the white cross is Dismas, so the black one is Gestus.
That's it. Now you could try pulling the switch. I could. Check it out. Something up there moved when you put the bucket on top. There's a channel running from the mechanism to the door. Okay. So bucket on top is good. Keep it there. There we go. Hey, Sam. Was dismissed to the left of Jesus? Uh, well, are you looking at them from the front or the back? From the front. Then, yeah, he was on the left. Okay, that's what I've got.
Okay, that's gotta be it. Now let's find out. Let's? So you're gonna pull the switch? Bob's today. So, if that was a test, what do you suppose it was testing exactly? Filling a bucket? I had to know about St. Dismas, whom I bet Avery and all of his crew were intimately familiar with. <laughs> Not that hard of a test. Whoa, watch your step. Size live and breathe. Would you look at this place? Okay, I'm guessing we need to get up to that broken bridge. Good guess. Let's look for a way up. Hey, come here. I'll boost you up there. Common. Okay, I got something for you up here. Use this to reach those handholds on the wall over there. Good call. Sure not making this easy, are they? I imagine it was easier when all the bridges and walkways weren't broken. <laughs> I guess we're a couple hundred years late. My ah, see some light through here. Makes sense. We're under a cathedral.
Anything noteworthy by the dormitories? Not unless you count some cleverly worded headstones. Have you finished digging by the chapter house? We have, ma'am. The northwest sites are wide open as well. And what about the southern perimeter? Not yet. It'll take us a day to move the crane over there. Nadine. Make it happen. In the meantime, see what you can dig up without it. I'll send a couple of men over right away. Good. Rafe, any luck with those manuscripts? Can we have a minute? Keep me updated. Yes, ma'am. Did you hear? They found a whole annexed area under the cathedral. I did. Have you seen it? No. Why? Because there wasn't much left after they'd finished finding it. My men have been a bit liberal with They're the garden like line. like a hundred well-armed bulls in a china shop. But they've made more progress in two days than we've made in months. Progress? I can't analyze rubble. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I'll let them know they need to give you a heads up before they do anything drastic. Or you can tell them to sit tight until I analyze the few clues that haven't been blown up. No, we can't sit around waiting any longer. All due respect, I think I have a bit more experience with this sort of thing than you do. We tried things your way. Bullshit. You've been wanting to level this place ever since we got here. No! I wanted to steal that cross long before it ever even made it to that auction. The same auction where I couldn't have my men around to deal with any surprises. The auction was the cleanest way but to get the cross. But instead of going with my gut, I'll listen to you. And now we have competition. Oh, well, I didn't think he'd show up. Or maybe you wanted to draw him out. <laughs> Why the hell would I do that? Because you think you need him. And maybe you do. Point is... I'm done trying to do things the clean way. If the treasure is here, we'll find it. And if not, well... Maybe it's time to move on, huh? Hey. It's not personal. Of course. I'll let you know if anything turns up. Get moving before they blow that treasure to bits. Oh, it's not making out. <laughs> hey, wait. You think she was right, though? About what? About Rafe wanting to draw you out. As long as he doesn't get the upper hand, who cares? Doesn't matter. <laughs> what annexed area you suppose they were talking about? It's gotta be some side chamber because we're the only ones here. A little too high to jump up there unless you got a trampoline. <laughs> Left it in my backyard. Oh, God. Hey, do you, do you have a trampoline? I wish.
Hang on. One crate coming up. I thank you, good sir. Well, we're definitely getting closer to the cathedral. Oh, what's left of it? Gotta say, this is far more sophisticated than I was expecting. <laughs> Me too. Must have taken years to build. Spared no expense to hide 400 million bucks. Here goes nothing. Good thing you're not heavier than the crate. Okay. Made it. What's the plan? I'm working on it.
We can hook our ropes onto this. That'll work. Who needs bridges? Oh no, I I wouldn't mind bridges per se. Well, can't go through there. So how do we get through? Over here. If this place wasn't completely falling apart, we'd probably be trapped again. Nathan, look around you. Holy crap. This must have been another test, but it all just crumbled into the ocean. Well, I guess the test now is... How the hell do we get to the other side? this That really safe-looking wooden seesaw thing might do the trick. Worth a shot. Well, here goes nothing. Here goes nothing. Nothing. 
Take the night to stop. You won't make it. You're too low. I'll weigh it down. Go. <laughs> Made it! All right! Uh, now, what about me? Right. Uh, just let me look around. Check out all that machinery. You know, it really makes you appreciate everything that goes into making one of these death traps. <laughs> Don't be glib. Any luck? Yeah, give me a sec. Okay, I found something to weigh down the seesaw. Excellent. You sure that'll work? It's heavier than I am. Nice air time. Uh, well, if treasure hunting doesn't work out, we can always join the circus. Uh, not if they have clowns. Well, still not over that, huh? No one is. another test down at this point I'd rather take another death trap at this point I hope we're at the end of this thing come on okay getting a bit dramatic with the statues here seriously why decorate a treasure burial site or build elaborate tests I mean either we're missing something or Avery was really really bored Ugh. I'll never get used to this. It's another cross. <laughs> At least this one has some jewels on it, right? Whoa, whoa, don't touch it. What? Why? <laughs> Look at it. It's the only valuable thing we've seen in this cave. Right. This is another test. Agreed. Yeah. Or lack thereof. Okay, so... It's... it's gotta be the coins. Yeah. Are we sure about this? Oh, pretty sure. Pretty sure we'll have to do. Right, just... just one now. Great. I got it. Recognize the shape? It's Madagascar. Look, star right here. It's King's Bay. Yes, it is. <laughs> Son of a bitch. He's screwing with us. What are you talking about? Avery, he's screwing with us. This was supposed to be it, so where's the goddamn treasure, huh? I mean, King's Bay, great. Well, what's next? North Pole? Outer space? Nathan. For those who prove worthy, paradise awaits. He, he was recruiting. Who was recruiting? Avery was recruiting. Recruiting for what? <laughs> <laughs> You gentlemen are very, very noisy. Guns on the floor. Slowly. Must have you from last time. Uh, throwing me out a window didn't do it for you? Rafe. Rafe, come in. I'm at the graveyard. Nadine, hey, we're here. 
Yeah, I'm looking at them right now. What? Where are you? Come back to the cathedral. Follow the holes. I'm on my way. And for God's sakes, don't shoot them yet. <sighs> Not want to hurry then. King's Bay. Yeah, but, uh, where in King's Bay? You'll need that cross over there to figure it out, but there's only two people that can tell you how to use it. Let me guess. You two. I'm gonna leave it to Rafe. You're gonna be waiting a long time. Sorry, boys. I'm not here to negotiate. Bring me the crucifix. It's not a crucifix. What? Well, technically, a crucifix refers to cross that... You know what? Never mind. Don't touch it! and set it on fire. I can hear the fireworks from here. What the hell's going on? 
Long story. Short version is get us the hell out of here. Yeah, figure. Hold tight. Be there as soon as I can. Say 
saying the weather is lovely this time of year? I can't see shit! Just keep heading down until we hit the water! Huh? Shut up my goddamn plane, mate. We're fine, thanks. How soon can you get us to Madagascar? No treasure, then. Not yet. I don't know what you're talking about. Look, we're rich. Jesus. I suppose it's a start. You think the rest is in Madagascar? Well, there was a chamber back there with a giant map of Madagascar on the floor, so... Yeah, it's probably there. This is beginning to smell a whole lot like wild goose, kid. Look, the treasure was never in Scotland, okay? Then what was the point of all that, huh? Of the St. Dismas Look, Cross? it's like I said. I think Avery was recruiting people. The cross was an invitation. The caves were just some sort of uh, initiation. Oh, so we all passed, huh? Congrats, Victor. We get eye patches and parrots now. I don't get it. Why the hell would they go to all that bother just to weed people out? To protect themselves. Look, Avery was the most wanted man in the world at that time. He had to enlist people that he could trust in order to keep their treasure secret. What do you mean, their treasure? Just think about this. Thomas II was a successful pirate in his own right. What would he possibly stand to gain from joining Avery? I think Avery sent out crosses only to the other wealthy pirates like himself. What if they pooled and hid all their treasure together? That would make the guns way all look like chump change. Exactly. Oh, holy shit. Okay, so where exactly in Madagascar are we going? Kings Bay. It was an old pirate haven back in uh, Avery's time. I know it well. It's a big place. Anything more specific? Well, that map chamber completely caved in, so, you know, 
<laughs> what are you laughing about? The people who survived the caves. The recruits. What's the one thing they would have left with? There's a volcano on this. <sighs> There's a volcano near King's Bay. Which means we need to get a move on. What do you mean? Well, you know, the news, there's been all that flooding. Maybe going to Malaysia during the monsoon season wasn't such a good idea. Yeah, right. Right, yeah, it, uh, it grounded us for sure. You know, had some equipment failure, but, you know, no one's hurt or anything. Well, as long as you guys are safe. So are you going to start work tomorrow? Uh, postponed, actually. Uh, looks like we're going to need maybe another 10 days or so. Ugh, 10 days? Hey, well, I, why don't I just uh, go ahead and buy a ticket then? Uh, you know, you don't have to do that. It's fine. I mean, you know, these guys always overestimate things. So I'm sure it'll be less time than that. Okay, well, you know, don't rush. Make sure that you're safe. Oh, I will. Always do. Uh, listen, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I gotta go. Jameson's calling me over. Okay. I love you. Love you, too. What are the satellites saying, Victor? Right now, not a goddamn thing. I lost the signal. Hey, you know what never loses signal? Paper. All right, this route right here should take us straight to the volcano. Might get a little bumpy, though. Let's get the show on the road. Gee. All right. The map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the world. So if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. One of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. Fingers crossed. I see some ruins up ahead. Wait here, I'll go take a look. <laughs> oh, Victor, you still do a lot of traveling these days? Yeah, I try. I tend to pick jobs that get me away from the computer. <laughs> yeah, I was telling Nathan, it's shocking how much of the business has moved to the internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options to get rid of Hot Cargo now. Yeah, sure. I prefer talking to clients face to face. Get a good read on them. Hard to do that in a chat room talking to some guy named Antiquity Master 37. Hmm. Not much to see here. Well, ah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. Hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest 4x4. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. Bridge there is what you would call rickety. <laughs> Sorry, 
Bump. We gotta get up to that bridge. Woo! <laughs> Colder than I thought. Would you look at that? Behind the waterfall. Oh shit. Try going up that hill. We can get to the bridge that way. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. Made it. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. I just keep, keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on. <laughs> ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Onward and upward. Ah, we're getting nowhere fast. I got mud in my mouth. <laughs> you need traction here. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. Easy. There we go. <laughs> Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy about? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. Going off-road, it might rain, might be muddy. But with Nate being so eager, he doubled the price. He would have doubled it anyway. We go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that winch. Hang on tight. Oh, gee. Shit. <laughs> I 
Take this slow, kid. Yeah. Nathan, you're thinking Avery, too, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on him. Sure. Maybe uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. Go check out that tower. I'll come with. <clears throat> Got some big plans for this winch. It's in pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. Definitely ruins from Avery Bell. <laughs> Do it. than it looks. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. <laughs> well, not yet. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. I right, just got to put the winch back and we'll be on our way. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine. You've come here, a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. <laughs> oh, poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. Taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor. Patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Sam. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a form of squid. The point is, we got it pretty easy. Yeah. Well, still taking a long time. Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. 
And that means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. You do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead. Okay, I think that's it. Damn it, Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. They, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. These pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? Again 
with the winch, Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Ray? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of mercenary. Rape's got the advantage there. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. He's thinking the same damn thing. What if they found the treasure already? Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Hey, Sam. You don't mind me asking. How'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. You know, come to think of it, I actually dealt with Alcazar a few decades ago, even before I met you two. Oh, shit. How are you still alive? Well, he wasn't quite the man he is today. Still working his way up the criminal ladder then. I sold his boss a few woodcut prints I'd smuggled out of Japan. He was into shoguns and such. Alcazar was the go-between. What was he like? Soft-spoken, but in... Check it out, boys. What is it? Hey guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline, Mercs? Can't tell. Well, it would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Drawbridge? How medieval. Yeah. Well, you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to keep people out. Or protect something inside. <laughs> Hey, Nathan, come check this out. Ah, hell, the stairs are busted. There's no way up to the crank. I'll see if I can find something to stand on. Hey, be careful, kid. Another sigil. So, do you recognize this one? I do, actually. Anne Bonny. Hmm? Operated out of the Caribbean. Thought she died in jail. At least that's what the stories tell us. <laughs> right. Avery must have invited her, too. Hey, kid. You see a big crate or something way up at the top of the tower. Maybe that'll do the trick.
Hey, guys. There's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Bingo. Sam! Yeah. You got this? Mm-hmm. I seen a few. I'll bring the car closer. You just relax. I got this. I mean, there's only one crying, you know. Keep up the good work, kid.
sweat. That bridge down. Let's try that again. Big tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? Yeah, not to nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? Take a look around. So just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, half. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist. Which is worth 400 million. <laughs> right, but if the theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure. Well, you should have told him it was 200,000. You never tell your partners how much a job is really worth. I don't exactly expect them to be partners. All set. Here we go. No, turn into it. Sharing this one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No, <laughs> but I will after this. Come on, you guys are overreacting. Get the whole thing under control.
Now, let's find our way in. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. <clears throat> Get in that way. Huh. Let's see what we got here. Careful with that thing, kid. Huh. Looks like there's something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Damn. It's breaked over. Heads up! Victor, this way! He seems excited. Uh, he's got a lot riding on this. Don't see a treasure, though. Hey, guys? Coming! Come check this out. St. Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas too. And that's, uh... Um... That's Adam Baldridge. That's uh, Joseph Farrell. And that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh... Let's see, what do you think the trick is here? 
Gotta push a button, pull something. Uh, maybe, maybe one of the arms or... Yeah, give it a shot. <coughs> Come on. Boys, whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this. Trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Victor, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so... If we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, our treasure's got to be in one of them, right? Yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here. Let's hope so. You okay? Yeah, yeah, fuck. Sam? Yeah, over here. <clears throat> hey, what are you doing? It's confirming a suspicion. Shit. Look at this.
They figured out the towers, too. Location, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed, okay? Because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. Well, that's great, Nathan, because neither do we. Yes, we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Yeah, you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. Crap. Uh, but still, two beats the hell out of 12. All right. I'm gonna take this tower. You and Sully, you take that no, one. No, 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 no. No, Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly. So if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Uh, Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. Damn it. Uh, if you run into any of those shoreline clouds, you call us, okay? See you soon. Come on, Nate. We gotta hurry. Yeah. All right, there's our tower. You really think all that treasure's gonna be just sitting in the middle of a goddamn market? Oh, yeah, that'd be crazy. But we've seen crazy before. That we have. Hey, Sully, I think we can squeeze through here. That'll work. <clears throat> you okay back there? You keep your pace, I'll keep mine. Yeah, well, at least you got a great view, right? Okay, let's see what we got. Wow. This place is in much better shape than the other towers. Edward England's sigil, just like the map said. So what are we looking for? Good question. Yes, it is. Hmm. Now, what do you bet? Thank you. 
Roger. <laughs> the Zodiac symbols. Look, there's Leo. Ah, Taurus. Four signs. Uh, four bells, way up there. And these things in the middle of the floor look like locks. Got it. Let's go ring some bells. This is definitely the place. Call Sam. On it. Scorpio, Aquarius, Leo, Taurus. Voice mail. Hey, Sam. Looks like we're at the right tower. Call us. They don't have the best coverage in this city. Well, no reason to wait. Be right back. Okay. Oh boy. I'll be damned. Check it out, Sully. The clock still works. Yeah, I noticed. Try not to get tangled in those gears up there. You bet. Thank <laughs> you. 
RPO lock just released. Okay, moving on to the next one. Bye. <laughs> 